This is not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment educational purposes only, and anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm stuff. So you get the videos I put them out. See what I'm thinking, see them analyzing that data, but I got tail every day. The day they release us is false, but it gives a false narrative of the market. We can make bad trading decisions. Listen, these criminals, these AMC criminals do not stop, but they are still very, very desperate for our shares and the numbers. And these are the numbers they're releasing to us, which means, in my opinion, the numbers are a whole lot worse. First of all, they have 50 days on the threshold list, okay? 50 days. And then... They had 38 million of volume, 38 million. And that's after the 10 to one reverse split. So in reality, that volume was 380 million counterfeit shares that were moved. And retail investors are not selling. So where are they getting these shares from? Where are they getting these shares from? I think they might be using ape as false locates that's just my opinion i have no proof of that but these millions of shares appeared out of thin air and we know that they're counterfeit shares we know they're counterfeit shares because this morning alone they have 3.2 million counterfeit shares available to to, to borrow at a cost of borrow of 9.6 percent but prior to the 10 to 1 reverse split that would mean they would have 32 million counterfeit shares available to borrow absolutely ridiculous they don't exist but think about this after the tetra one reverse split they still can't cover they still can't cover that tells me of the trillions of counterfeit shares that they have available and then you got to remember that these bad actors shorted 23 million amc shares yesterday 23 million where did these shortest shares come from where and then if you look at it before the 10 to 1 reverse split they shorted 230 million counterfeit amc shares i mean about half the entire float was shorted the original float was shorted yesterday absolutely crazy and here's the thing if y'all have all these millions of real AMC shares available to short, why can't y'all deliver those shares and get off the threshold list? Why can't y'all deliver those shares and get off the threshold list? And on top of that, you have all these millions of counterfeit, of, oh, well, y'all say it's real shares, but I know it's counterfeit AMC shares. You have all these millions of AMC shares available to borrow, yet... You have apes in the United States and all over the world who have not received their AMC shares yet. So you don't have shares to deliver to the people who bought the shares, who are entitled to the shares, but somehow you have shares to trade every day to illegally manipulate the price. But of course, the SEC does not see a problem. Anyway, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Do you think it's possible that they don't have shares to deliver to the people that bought them, to the people who are entitled to them, but somehow they find millions of shares to short into, monarch, into the market and manipulate the price of AMC every single day? Anyway, have a great day. God bless. I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.